NGO is Lend a Hand. The purpose of our NGO is to help get rid of racism in South Africa. Without Lend a Hand, racism would still continue to be a big problem in South Africa. Lend a Hand started when three members of a group had a project to work on. They studied that um, racism in South Africa had been going on for many years and they wanted to help end it. Lend a Hand came up with this slogan, Your Steps, Our Actions. This fits our organization because when you take steps, you are helping us donate, and when you donate, we take actions to help prevent racism in South Africa. Uh, our logo was a handprint on our, on our NGO named Lind Linda Hand. For my essay? Where's my? Oh, she's, yeah, if you just tell her what to pull up, she will. Okay. My thesis statement was the economy and government that was changed and affected by the white minority of South Africa has created much racism. And I have four paragraphs after that. The first one is talking about how uh, migration uh, increased the uh, population, which helped, which, uh, w which affected the economy. But see, the government was the people that affected the economy most because the white minority took over the government when they uh, colonized. So that meant that they were like the economy, the con people, the white people had a better con like had be gave gave them more money, and they had better housing and stuff like that. And that's um, and there's um, in my last paragraph it talks about economy called apartheid economy that was trying to be created in the 1970s but it failed. My history essay. Um, well, the concept of racism developed because of European colonialism. Apartheid is the system in which it separates people according to their race to um, various regions to accomplish different tasks. In the system they used, it was called um, the Population Registration Act, and in that system they broke down all of South Africa's races into four main groups, the blacks, whites, colored, and Indians. Based on this, they got their role in society, which is determined by s racial segregation. During the rise of many technological advancements in Europe, South Africa was unsuccessful in getting those advancements due to the isolation. Then Europe decided to colonize Africa. Racism still exists and contributes to more power for the whites. Due to, due to the triangular trade, Africa traded their slaves to America, in which America traded sugar, tobacco, and cotton to Europe, and Africa got gum, rum, and cloth in exchange. Since racism is one of the many conflicts going on in Africa, it is important to its history. Okay, and my essay... Um, in South Africa, there is still much racism, even though it seems like the government um, is doing much. In fact, they're not. Um, there's still um, racism inside the government. Like, um, inst yeah. Um, in some professions, there are problems and issues that are um, race-specific. But the number of excess black-specific associations show that race <laughs> racial concerns still drive almost every field of achievement in South Africa. Now we'd like you to watch our propaganda commercial. Hey guys, hey guys, guys, can we up? It's really, it's supposed to like, show like, how racism starts, like people just try to walk up to you and say, hey, can we do this or that, and then like... in the middle. Play in the middle? Oh, yeah, yeah, we should do that. Play in the middle. It doesn't go That's all right. That's like how people. Hey guys, like, hey guys, guys. And then like there, they're like, hey. you know, people beat you up and like that for like trying to say something. And that like how people think that like, like some some of us are getting really dirty. Lend a hand is a foundation that helps get rid of racism in South Africa. While this issue is an ongoing problem, we have decided to stop it. 
Racism is the belief of being discriminated by someone other than your race. If this happens, then it won't be right in South Africa or in any other place in the whole world. That's why Linda Hand has decided to put an end to this issue and please donate to help this issue. Inclusion to racism in South Africa. We have decided to solve this problem. Can you please get flowers and leaves? Our solution was created by a concha, and she decided that people need to be more aware of racism to get the government to change apartheid and discrimination. Something must be done to get many people to speak up. To do this, we could create websites, speak to the public, or any other ways of spreading awareness. The target focus should be on the youth because they hold the key to the future. Wanda Han plans to do this by traveling to South Africa and spreading awareness. And scroll down to this. Uh, this is just something um, on racism, like different people that help try to stop racism in South Africa, like uh, Helen Suzman, Albert Lululi, Dennis Goldberg, and uh, Nelson Mandela. They all try to stop racism back when it was, well, they started to help. They still help and sometimes and they um, help try to stop racism.